just sort of give you an update on the uh, X Tech, or also known as the Zoom HB100 uh, cable pool hydraulic brakes. Uh, to highly recommend them. I've used used them for about 700 kilometres, um, or 700 plus kilometres. Uh, and with these, I've even purchased them for uh, someone else's bike as well. Um, when I got them, I got the disc rotors as well. Don't think I needed them. Um, put them on. Uh, really haven't noticed any difference uh, with it. But uh, excellent braking power with the X-Tech, uh, also known as the Zoom um, HB. HB100, you can see the, the zoom there. Got this using semi hydro, um, semi metallic brake pads on them, and so uh, this is the rear rear one. Uh, they don't get uh, squealing on them, so which is excellent. And even uh, you can see from the bike, it's uh, quite a heavy bike, so they have carry panniers and um, do 70 plus kilometer rides. And um, they look excellent. I'd, I've, um, if I was riding um, any other bikes that had cable pull uh, brakes on them, I would put these on them. And um, yes, not as good as hydraulic, obviously, but for a cable pull brake, the best brake I've used now on this on that bike, these are the ones that came off it. Um, these ones, the Z Stars, did squeal. Um, I've got some others. Uh, that are using these brakes, yeah, they do have issues with squealing, especially once they've got water um, contaminated with some uh, oil from the road. And then these ones here are better than the Z Stars that I've got. I don't know what these are. So these um, uh, retrospect, which obviously is a rebrand of something, um, don't know what they are. They're quite good, nowhere near as the uh, the Zoom ones. So. HP 100s and these are all crystal bikes uh, also I think known as avocado or Twitter um, bikes um, with these so which you can see the, the brand there um, highly recommend these zoom brakes I haven't leaked oil at this stage um, and for the price I think I paid like 60 odd dollars Australian uh, for them delivered 60 or 70 and great value now they are single um uh what do you call it? caliper so basically you know, only the, the left hand side uh pushes the uh, uh the pad into uh, the disc rotor into the other one um but really easy to adjust uh you can see from the just really nice you don't have to pull a lot on it and that's the brake um you can lock up you lock up the wheels on the on these brakes um easily lock them up um, and with these tires so these are the marathon e plus um tires great stopping because i you know, ride this to work and i need to be safe um and yeah and i have quite heavy pa heavy panniers on it and that just pulls up um don't don't have any issues um overheating these um i have ridden um, say around the Otways um, in Victoria, um, Great Ocean Road, places like that, more so the Otways, quite hilly, and they just pull you up. Highly recommend these uh, brakes. Thank you.